in this lecture we are going to learn about scope actually a scope work as a glue between view and controller mm. currently we have a controller called controller and it, it's having object array and in the HTML file we have used ng repeat to display this object array and you can see in the app.js you used this keyword and in the index.html also when you assign a controller you assign as object into a controller but if you are going to use a scope you can remove these things because the scope is work as a glue between view and controller we will see how we are going to use a scope in the script file first I need to inject a scope into the controller I'll use dollar mark scope and in the function I need to get this scope return and I just used a scope and I need to close this square bracket here right and I'm going to remove a scope I'm going to sorry I'm going to remove this keyword using a scope right now you cannot see any data in the output now I am going to the index.html and I am going to remove this controller as con one thing just put only controller and we will remove this con one dot and we will see yes it works I have used a scope I have removed this and I have used a scope in the html file i have removed as keyword as object assigning and you can see the scope is work as a glue between controller and view and i'm going to tell how to create sub application inside of the main application our main angular application is app 12 and I'm going to create a sub application for that first create JavaScript file called product and inside of JavaScript file I'm going to create a sub application or app equal angular.module uh, my sub application is products and I'm going to get this the main application controller inside of the sub application and I have created a sub application called product inside of that I have a controller and I want to inject this sub application into main application for that I will create a dependency for products and now I have created the main application called app 12 and sub application called products in the index.html I need to bring this javascript file src js yes you can see i have a main app angular application called app 12 inside of that i have a products sub angular application and in the sub angular application having a controller with object array and i have imported both the script files into the html and you can see this controller is inside of this sub application and ng repeat object array is in the sub application but i have called to the main application here now you can see how we can create sub applications 
inside of the main application. 